Thinking in terms of good and evil merely indicates a limited imagination, in my opinion. Now, where did I set my traps? Was it Lower Hogsfield? Or up there? Mr. Tennyson. I haven't a clue why there's such a fuck. Well, I'll check your pockets up to your dead. It's shameful what you've done to helpless beasts. Rebellion. This be Mr. Oakes's campsite? Just now. Should I take them by force? Be discreet. Repair them. How nice of you, stop by. Lumos. Incendio. Rebellion. Mr. Oaks's trade journal. Adelaide said that her uncle kept notes of his trades, maps. Perhaps these landmarks will lead me to him. Revelio. Descender. Repulsa. This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. Revelio. Wrote his trade journal. Incendio!
Revelio. Marlin trial when I see one. A rock formation? That's the first landmark on this map. Now to find the crooked tree. Repairer! Guardian Leviosa. Repairer. Tracy. Compulsor. Leviosa. Defender. Accio. Expelliarmus. Incendio. Repairer. Was like a polite battle. Action! It's a You're this on the same treasure. You're a slippery little shrike, aren't you? Incendio! One less poacher in the wizarding world. Tree, just as the map said, a crumbling town. Far from here.
Revelio. And the crumbling tower. The spot on the map should be directly south of here. Revelio. You should know better than that by now. We've all talked before, and look what happened. Accio. Incendio! Accio! Expelliarmus! Confringo! When the war is over, goblins will rule over with What do we have here? This looks like trouble. Revelio. Hmm. I may have more luck higher up in the keep. Repair her. sorts of secrets. A ladder. That's what I need. Wizard kind will submit to us once the war. What? Such arrogance. Send me. Ah, 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 Thank you. 
best place for an undercover. This is the spot on the map. I'd best have my wits about me. to attend by myself. Incendio, Accio. Good for you, Expelliarmus. 
Incendio. Kim Dringo, Expelliarmus. Should think they felt that in London. Guardian Leviosa. Rebellion. I don't like the looks of that encampment. Now oh, here's a sign. Rebellio. What will we find in here? Revelio. Incendio. 
Send him. You only have Ranrock to blame. Rebellion. Send it. Incendio.
Rebellion. Send you. This must be Mr. Oaks's wand. Perhaps now he can set himself free.
光转发。Hello, Mr. Oaks. Yes, I'm here. They've taken my wand. This cell has an enchanted lock. I had experience with these locks, but I need my wand if I have any chance of opening it. Look for a boiler door. I've heard them speak of it. Fortunately, I've already found your wand, Mr. Oaks. Oh, you found it! Pass it to me. Hurry, before they come. I must get out. Hurry! Oh, my wand. Oh, thank Merlin. Thank you. You did it! Oh, you found my wand and... Wait, you're a student? Oh, we must get you to safety immediately. It's dangerous. It's all right, Mr. Oaks. I've dealt with these goblins before. Dear Merlin, you're either very lucky or very talented. How did you find me? I'm a friend of Adelaide's. She was worried about your business with Ranrock's loyalists. Oh, she was right to be. I couldn't go through with the agreement, and when I told them, I ended up blindfolded and behind bars. Been locked in that infernal cell for so long, they'd forgot I was even there. I overheard things. If only I could reward you for what you've done. Blasting goblins stole every canut on me. All I can say is thank you, truly. You mentioned you overheard things. <sighs> Sad tale, really. I think I know where Ramrock's unfortunate vendetta against wizardkind began. Although dragon breeding was outlawed by the Warlocks Convention of 1709, Ranrock stumbled upon an illegal dragon camp. He was young, found the creatures fascinating. He'd visit the camp in secret whenever he could, never making his presence known. After weeks of sly surveillance, he finally summoned the courage to speak to the wizard in charge. Ranrock wanted to join them and the creatures. The wizard happened to drop his wand. Ranrock saw an opportunity. He picked it up, went to hand it back as a, a means of introducing himself. The sight of a goblin with a wand sent the wizard into an instant rage. He beat Ranrock nearly to death. Ever since, Ranrock has despised wizard kind, sees us all as cruel. Am I right that you speak gobbledygook? Unbeknownst to Ramrock's fiends, I do. I've always had an affinity for goblin culture. Knew I wanted to be a metal trader ever since I was a lad. It wasn't easy learning the language. It's, it's complex. And my memory's as weak as my knees these days. But after decades working with fine goblin folk, I grew fairly proficient. At least, I'd like to think so. I'm grateful I was able to help you, Mr. Oaks. Adelaide thinks the world of you. Oh, and I her. She's become quite savvy to my trading habits, always analyzing my detailed owls. Oh, if only I hadn't resorted to trading with such fiends. A lesson I shan't soon forget. Having my wand back is like being reunited with an old friend. I must return home and inform Adelaide of my safety. Will you be all right? I'll be fine, Mr. Oaks. You get back to Adelaide. I assure you, her worries outweigh yours. Oh, I'm anxious to see my dear niece. And then I plan to travel far from here for my next round of trading. Thank you. May life reward you justly for your deeds. Be well, my friend. Mr. Oaks.
Mr. Rokes was lucky. Hanrock's lot would never have freed him. Hello, Hamora. Incendio! Too late for you to learn the error of Rebellion. 